The origins of bread making are shrouded in mystery, but we do know that the ancient Egyptians were the first to make sourdough bread around 1500 BC. Although we can only speculate about how they discovered it, one thing is certain. Sourdough has been a staple of human diets for millennia. Sourdough is more than just a tasty bread. It has a host of health benefits as well. The fermentation process makes the vitamins and minerals in the bread more easily digestible, and the bread is low glycemic, which means it won't cause blood sugar spikes. Additionally, sourdough is a source of natural probiotics and prebiotics, which can benefit your tummy. The process of making sourdough is a magical one. It all begins with a starter, which is a mixture of flour, water, and a little bit of sugar. As the starter sits at room temperature, wild yeast from the air and grains settle into the mix. And then the fermentation begins. This process gives the starter its characteristic sour smell. And it's what makes sourdough bread so delicious. As the dough rises, gas bubbles form and expand creating the spongy texture that we all know and love. When the bread is baked at high temperatures, the bubbles can expand even further until the yeast die off, resulting in a crusty, flavorful loaf of bread. Sourdough starters are the heart and the soul of sourdough bread making. They have a nearly 6,000-year history that spans the globe. They've been passed down from generation to generation. The bakers of San Francisco, in particular, have a special affinity for their sourdough starters. Since the California Gold Rush in 1848, master bakers from France have been using the same sourdough culture, which they affectionately call Mother Dough. The starter is so important that it was heroically saved by Louis Boudin during the Great San Francisco Earthquake of 1906. Keeping a sourdough starter alive and healthy is a bit of an art form. Starters need to be fed equal parts water and flour every couple weeks, just to very simply keep them thriving. And as the years go by, the starter develops more tanginess, more personality, making it a treasured member of the family. One of the most fascinating things about sourdough bread is how it can benefit your health. Research suggests that sourdough bread can help with blood sugar control, reduce cholesterol, lower the risk of diabetes, and improve weight control. It's also packed with vitamins, minerals, and antioxidants, making it a nutritious addition to any diet. When making sourdough, it's important to use the right tools. Glass or ceramic bowls and containers are best, as metals like aluminum, iron, or steel can corrode or pit with acidic ingredients. It's also best to use wooden or silicone utensils instead of metal ones. Sourdough bread. It's a testament to the ingenuity and resourcefulness of the human spirit. From its humble beginnings in ancient Egypt to its modern-day status as a beloved staple of the San Francisco food scene, sourdough has captured the hearts and taste buds of people from all over the world. So why not give it a try? You just might be surprised by how delicious and nutritious it can be. And remember, when it comes to sourdough bread, grumpy loaves are always called sourdough. These are interesting things with JC.